Hello everyone, Kevin Gurkley here from Tech Formality, the blog that focuses on tech guides, tech news, and tech reviews. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at Avast free antivirus once again. But in this video, we are going to be testing against um, known ransomware uh, samples that I have downloaded from multiple sources. And uh, also, my friend Alex, I will comment as, uh, or put a link up to his channel here. Please do subscribe to him. He is very good with uh, prevention tests as well. And the same content that I upload, uh, we work together on some things. He has shared his malware samples and ransomware samples with me as well. So we will go ahead and put all of these to a test uh, in just a minute. We will run down through and see how Avast does on all of these known ransomware items. So if you stick with me for just a minute, we'll go ahead and uh, start the video. All right, and here we are with uh, Avast on here, and uh, as you can see, we are on the Avast free version. Uh, let's go ahead and turn the shields on, and as you can see the protection, we do have the ransomware shield enabled, and our protection um, paths currently are documents, pictures, and desktop. So this basically stops ransomware and entrusted apps from changing, deleting, or holding your personal photos and files hostage. So as you can see on the desktop here, we have two images, um, and then on, uh, or in our uh, documents, I do have an Avast corporate fact sheet here. So it does have a PDF document there. Uh, so we will see if those get encrypted whenever we do run the test. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I did turn everything back on. So we will be running uh, Vast full force with all the shields enabled and um, enjoy the music. The night has come, it's cold and losing my control. Your light is gone, and lonely darkness fill my soul. I wish that you could save me from my isolation. It's way too complicated, let's stop this conversation. Stop this conversation We got no relation Take me, 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 take me,
here, and as you can see, there are only five items remaining in the ransomware folder um, after executing all of the uh, ransomware samples there. Uh, the majority of them were blocked. Um, nothing was let through. I could not run a majority of them for some odd reason. It could be that it's not compatible with Windows or it's just the operating system. Um, so these are the ones that are left over after running a scan of this folder. So now what we're going to do is go ahead and run a full scan here um, with Avast and see what we can come up with on the computer side of things. As you can see here, our files are untouched and nothing seems to be encrypted. Um, so that is looking very good here uh, on the side of things for Avast. So let's go ahead and initiate a full scan. And once we go ahead and do a full scan, uh, we will go ahead and be back with the results. And then we will also run a scan with Malwarebytes and Hitman Pro to see what they have to say about uh, the computer as well. So we'll be back here in just a sec. Okay, we are back here. And as you can see, there's no malware found from the Avast free antivirus full scan. So we're going to go ahead and in install Malwarebytes and Hitman Pro. And we will go ahead and run full scans with those softwares and see what the uh, second opinion scans have to say about this. So let's go ahead and fully install Malwarebytes and run a Hitman Pro scan, and we will be back with those results here in just a minute. Okay, and we are back here with the final scans, and as you can see here on the left, that uh, Malwarebytes free edition scan uh, finished with finding three total items, and these are all items that are in the ransomware folder, um, so these are all not detected by Avast, as well as on Hitman Pro side of things. Uh, the PC toaster also was in the ransomware folder. The combo fix is a false positive. Um, so it did find the PC toaster as well as being malicious. Um, so with that being said, I did upload all these to virus total just to see what the stats were on them. They were all detected by various antiviruses. This SMB, um, this one here, the zero or C O C three, five C A J N was actually detected by a vast on virus total. So I'm not quite sure why it was not detected in this test here. Um, but these were all malicious softwares that we're not able to run on the computer. Uh, they are malicious still, so we, even though we can't run them, they are considered as malicious files. So how, overall, after going through and running, uh, I believe, 150 samples, we couldn't run some of them because they weren't compatible with the operating system. Avast did remove every single one of them uh, that we were able to run, and 48 additional ones, I believe, from the full or the scan of the malware folder, ransomware folder that we ran. So overall, very good job by Avast Free Edition. As always, our files are still unencrypted. We are good to go. Um, so that'll do it for this video, and I hope you enjoyed it. Please do comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. Um, if you have any questions, you can comment below, and I will answer them as they come in. If you um, want to see more, you can actually go to my tech blog, techformality.com, blog that focuses on tech guides, tech news, and tech reviews, and there's a contact button in the top right corner there. If you have any questions for me and you wanted to send them in a private manner, you can hit the contact button in the top right, and I will respond to them as soon as I possibly can. And I thank you for watching and hope you guys have a good one. Thank you.